guys, it's Queen Nija, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode 24 of I Cut to One Parade. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. <clears throat> That was the best performance freaking he made of music here. Well, I think we got like what one more episode before we're at the end of season one and before season two starts. So maybe her sister might give her the uh, the answer in this episode or in the season one finale. That's cute. <laughs> they have plushies of it and I want one so bad. It's so fucking Oh my god. I just remember like so long ago in season three and season four of OG and that thing was so freaking cute and I was like, why don't they have merch of it? And then it takes the fifth oh, no. Fifth or sixth? Seventh, eighth? Whatever anniversary we're on Friday Cut for them to finally make a freaking merch for it. And I just want it so bad. Please, for the love of God, let either honey cat or love me here. For more, please. Thank <laughs> you. 
It would have been nice to have all of them perform, but I get it. You don't have time. You just got to be like, here, 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 here. Hmm? Oh, it's starting to rain. You can't pick all those frogs up by yourself.
Oh, okay.
Uh, you know what let me say this real quick this feels like the last episode even though we still got one more it just feels like the last one <laughs>
gonna color it. I, I just love how Ichigo is just popping up, like, yep, let me make a cute little appearance real quick. <laughs> I thought she was gonna say something for a moment, but then they were like, nope, cut. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, final thoughts. Even though not really. This was a good episode. And the three-part episode was just... Mm, mwah. Loved it. It was good. It was a good event. It makes you kind of think that both Wakaba and Rocky are going to possibly be in a friend unit together. Especially with the fact that when Rocky came in and I was like, oh, are you, is that what's going to happen? But honestly, really, who knows? It was just so good. Future. Oh my god, like, okay, here's the number one thing. I'm not really ready for this last episode because, number one, this is officially the last time that Aikatsu will be on TV until fall, so it'll be two whole seasons <laughs> without this show, even though the show is continuing online. I don't know if they're gonna really, if people are gonna see that it's going from airing on TV to officially airing online specifically on the YouTube channel, if it is going to get subbed. I don't know if it's going to take longer. It's a lot of unanswered questions with it, but this episode and the three-parter for focusing on each of these schools, even though they still didn't really focus on Neo Venus arc, but in a way they did, and incorporating all these different idols and then showing the Friends unit at the end because they're the most recent show. It was interesting, and I loved it for what they did, The per I mean, at the parade. The event was really good. Rocky did such a good job. I'm proud of her and everyone else who was in this show and who has been able to perform. I mean, I would have loved to see a whole bunch more idols perform, but I get the fact is there's time crunch. It's only a three-parter episode, and you can't really have exclusively everyone who you wanted to perform. Like I said, the best performance was he, <laughs> he a music key hands down. I'm sorry, because... I wasn't expecting that. I think the second best was probably when Ichigo, you know, because her voice actress, even though she's doing bigger and better things, she still comes back to this show to voice not one, not two, but three characters and still be able to have time to sing because this is a girl who's in um, BNA currently right now and then she's possibly getting ready for season two of Promise Neverland and then if she does still have time or if Ichigo is going to be in the second season of I Cut to One Parade, she's still gonna have time. Plus, with the fact that she's starting her, she's continuing her singing career. I know she's having a CD that's coming out ASAP, but honestly, I mean, 
to me was the one, aka Ichigo's voice actress, was the one who started this show. And honestly, it's just, it's good, but it's also bittersweet and heartwarming because this really felt like the last episode, and then this next episode is truly the last episode that'll be airing, and it's just like, dang, you really just don't want it to, like, come, but it's gonna come, it's gonna be here on Saturday, and it's gonna be really sad, but also happy because this show has been with me and possibly countless others for, like, the longest time, but to finally have this last episode not officially air on tell I mean air on television but then season two airing online. It's gonna feel a little weird for some people, but who knows? Other than that guys, that was my reaction to you towards episode twenty four of I Cut to Lamp Parade. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like it really helps me out. Also subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad and of course I will see you guys officially all hopefully either next Sunday or next Monday. I'm not one hundred percent sure for the final episode of season one of I Catch One Free, but until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye!